Hi friends, this is Sheshanand from Aerotech Solutions. This is application with keypad and LCD with Arduino controller. So here I'm just taking two individual peripherals. One is display, which is 16 cross to LCD, and the second peripheral is 4 by 3 keypad. And these two peripherals connected with Arduino, you know. So the connections with the keypad, you have to follow these rows and columns. So just this is symbolic representation. The four wires you need to use for rows, and these three for columns. So these four by three keypad connected with the Arduino across the IOs from four, five, six, seven, eight pins. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So these seven IOs I am using for keypad purpose. And the LCD, you have to go with the connections like RS, enable, and four data lines, and two power supply lines. So this RS enable connected across 11 and 12, and the four data lines. So D4 line is connected across 13, and remaining D, D5, D6, D7 are connected with, uh, generally Arduino, you know, which come up with A0 to A5 so but you can you can make it make it as IO number 14 15 16 17 18 it follows the 13 it will end up here and from 14 so there is a A0 or 14 you can use for digital purpose also so this and two power supply connections 5 volts and ground so these two I just connected with the LC so this is my hardware connections with the peripherals with my Arduino. Now I'm writing a simple logic. So I just took two individual header files, one for keypad which is keypad.h and LCD purpose LCD liquid liquid crystal.h. Now I'm clearly mentioned here the IO connections of Arduino which is 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. And I am just defining here rows, how many rows from my keypad and how many columns. And what is the value you are expecting on screen, which is predefined here. For row 0 and column 1, so the value is 1. So that should follow. And I am here, the mentioning here, the rows connections with the Arduino. 4, 5, 6, 7 is connected across rows. And column pins are connected with 8, 9, 10 pins. And this is a standard function for keypad. It will return your key value, whatever you are typing from the keypad. And doing some simple setup, the serial communication begins and LCD display begins. And whatever the text you are expecting initially, you can, you can display with the first line. And to send the cursor to second line, you need to make it 0, 1. And this is the text I am giving for second line. And waiting for 5 seconds time. And then trying to clear my screen. Because reading the value from keypad, trying to display it on LCD. So this is the standard function, standard macro you need to use to get the key value from keypad. So that will return your keypad value to key variable key data type character and if if you are getting something to the key value so that i am allowing to display to serial as well lcd so this output i'll show you with hardware so i'm going to turn on my hardware watch the initial message on whatever i try to display is Aerotech Solutions is the my name and please subscribe our channel from YouTube. Now LCD is cleared and I'm trying to open a serial window also from Arduino. So the key value the key value I am trying I will show you from 1 to 9 from the keypad. So typing key value 1 and 2 3 
four five six seven eight nine star zero hash so this is a very simple application with the Arduino So I'll show you the same output with serial window also. From the keypad, I'm trying to give it inputs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, star, zero, hash. So this is how you can cross check your output with serial window also. Thanks for watching.